Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Pete reacting to my favorite Brazilian guitarist. Yeah, so as some of you know, Vinny's Brazilian and I'm from the States. So in this video series, Vinny takes some of his favorite Brazilian guitars who I've never heard of. We take a look at them and see what I think. That's right. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, bro. So this guy's pretty interesting. Okay. Like he's, uh, he's just a classic on the internet. Yeah. You know? His name is Fernando Miata and he is, is probably the, the first ever viral guitar video I've ever seen, you know. Uh, the video we're gonna watch today has 16 million views. 16 yeah? million. 16 million. And it, 16 million and it, was, and it was posted in uh, 2006. So I remember when that came out, like, it was like everyone was watching it, you know. I remember there was two virals, actually. Uh, there was that one and the Canon Rock. Have you uh, seen that I remember one? The Canon Rock one. Canon Rock. Yeah. Everyone was crazy yeah, about that it. That one, yeah. I, was, I went crazy for that video. Yeah, yeah. Uh, like, according to my memory, those were the first ever two like guitar virals you know yeah uh and you can see the quality of this is very old school yeah and then then all of a sudden it was this brazilian guy you know uh just doing uh this insanely amazing guitar solo yeah that's the title of the video you know so this is more of a, a, a tribute to early youtube days you know yeah, and yeah. how how crazy it was when this guy blew up all over the place you know now the cool thing about him as well, Fernando Miata, is that do you remember when we did uh, Gustavo Guerra's mm -hmm. react? Do you remember how I told you that he won uh, the very first uh, ever guitar guitar idol competition? Yeah. Yeah. So in two thousand and eight <clears throat> was the first guitar guitar idol competition, uh, which was like an online competition. Everyone posted a video. And then the finals the finals were held in London, you know, uh, and then obviously there were judges and everything, and that was done in person. That first year, 2008, Gustavo Guerra won. Tom Quayle as well was in the finals the, that, that year. And he was in the finals as well. Ah! So, so they had two Brazilians that yeah. year, Gustavo and him. Yeah. He was a runner-up, he didn't win. Gustavo won, but he, he was in London in 2008. Wow. You know, for, the, for, the, for the competition, yeah. So yeah. that's pretty cool, man. Yeah, like, he, cool. he's been around, he's, uh, he's pretty famous all over the, the internet, you know. Uh, in the guitar community and he i think these days he he works really closely with uh, roland and boss as a demonstrator uh so there we go so check it out let's check it out all right let's do it all right <laughs> this is such this is so nostalgic you know to watch this oh i got the quality <laughs> yeah oh there we go Before full HD yeah. was a thing. It's this is there's a charm to it though. Yeah, this one videos were like that. Yeah. yeah. Good sounds in it. Serious phase going on there. Yeah. Webby. Do I see his little scallops there as well? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I think so. From the 15. From the, yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Crazy, right? <laughs> the run? Yeah, and it's like the, it's that choked, muted uh, yeah. sound as well, which is really cool. Exactly. And it's happening like it's nobody's business, but no big deal to him. No, it comes out naturally in the middle of the improv, you know. There we go again. 
just real quick that technique to me is so impressive because yeah. I've never I don't I've never studied it at all I, yeah. don't know how, I have no idea how it's done it's very specific man I think you almost need some obviously like you need some serious dedication for anything but for that it's like because yeah. uh, Kiko is really good at that Kiko two handed tapping and Tosin Abasi are the two yeah. people that I've seen kind of and I remember Kiko in an interview saying that he dedicated like a good I don't remember what what was it exactly but like two years like yeah. Just it just played like that playing all the like time, that, playing yeah. playing mainly like that to yeah. be, become fluid with it. Yeah. It's like, to be honest, it's like it's almost like learning another instrument in it. Oh, because it's completely different. Like the approach is completely yeah. different. Obviously, you have dexterity with the left hand already, but everything's different. You yeah. know, yeah. the mirroring, everything. You know, yeah, it's yeah. like scales are like yeah. completely different. The, yeah. you, you can imagine your coordination. You know, yeah. between the two hands. You yeah. know, and then do, muting as well. You know. Yeah, exactly. Being clean with that yeah, stuff. Yeah, you yeah. know. Uh, that reminds me actually, there's another Brazilian guy that we can actually, I can actually show you that does that really well. Yeah, cool. To be continued. <laughs> Sounds like Nudo right there. It's so raw, isn't it? Flamenco vibes. Very cool. Thumb action. Oh yeah, like double thumb, like that. Yeah. Again, stamina, pretty insane. Exactly, it's good for like four minutes. Yeah. There we go. Pull it back. Back to the ring. Yeah, it's got some good use of effects as oh, well, you know? I like that a lot. Yes. Fernando Miata. Wow. Man. Our well, faces have just been melted <laughs> off. <laughs> this is the thing, like, this this video is, uh, is just, it just represents, like, almost like a summary of how joyful the guitar can be yeah. you know you see this guy like very unassuming you know obviously when that came out even less like you check out the video you open it's like and then all that happens you know yeah. it's like the guy's just playing like very raw like joyful kind of thing yeah. doing obviously loads of stuff you know yeah, it yeah. is the insanely amazing guitar solo but it's real you know like yeah, yeah, yeah. no tricks yeah. nothing no, it's just he's playing all those techniques yeah you know pure excitement you know wow. that was yeah yeah, what did you think so, of it? Oh, it's cra it's, yeah, it's face melting. It's yeah, like, it's yeah. just a normal guy and just like has, yeah. having a jam for five minutes. And <laughs> yeah. That out, you know? yeah, everything. I also wanted to show you something more recent of him, you know, and I found this video from t uh, 2011. That's uh, a bit more recent, but there's nothing super recent, you know, of him mm -hmm. shredding. You know, there's other more professional videos of him, like I said, working with boss and boss and stuff. Yeah, so another couple of minutes of pretty impressive shred. Okay. It's called Improvisation by Fernando Miata, you know. Uh, so let's see what happens when he's uh, improvising. Because the other song was a composition, you know. The, uh, the yeah, other tune yeah. was like uh, the insanely amazing guitar yeah, solo. Yeah, it's exactly, yeah, it's exactly the same as he played in, in the finals in London. It was his tune, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here he's, uh, he's improvising. So let's see how this goes. Scallops in the octave position again. Yeah, man. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Like just up so. Yeah, then you get the normal stuff for frets and stuff here, yeah, I know. Oh, I love those chromatics. No pick in there. He does a little. Look, look, look. He's not holding one. No, no, no. I don't. Uh, maybe he was. 
I but, think he hides it maybe really yeah, nicely. Yeah, he definitely hit it because like there was one point where he was strumming just with yeah. his thumb and then he did some hybrid stuff. Oh, so there you go. He's hiding yeah. the pick way before all the R&B guys were doing it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, like, there's something about the way he plays that's like, you know, when you see a player that has so much personality, you know, mm. the, way the way his hands move, there's some sort of, almost like a class to it, you yeah. know? Yeah, I It's agree. very classy, yeah. but very genuine, original, but still tidy. Yeah. You know, he's not quirky or anything, yeah, you know? Yeah, he's yeah. not, like, weird, like, Marty Friedman weird, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah. He's still, like, very, like, you can see, like, he's very tidy and <laughs> he's got very, like, um, precise technique but he's not a robot you know I think that's what I'm trying to say do you know who I um, say in that point you know who I think also has that is Oziel when he oh, plays okay. he's, like, he's, he's very very tidy but at the same time the way it's, it's very classic yeah. movements you know, his technique yeah there's like cool. a, almost like a little dance like yeah, yeah. there's like a little yeah it's, it's, it's weird to explain there's a relaxed vibe around it yeah. you know Yeah. but it's still like shredding like crazy yeah. you know yeah, yeah interesting <laughs> Luis Khalil does that really well as well. Yeah. You know, yeah, when yeah, you knew yeah. everything, you go, like, and you go that, crazy, yeah, yeah. you know. Ah. It's like the Steve Vai thing as well. Yeah, like, like quickly, you know, I love yeah. that stuff, you know. Very cool. Look at that three finger. Oh. Yeah, click on the knee again. Those big jumps, man. That's crazy, man. The, just the effortlessness between the two hands. Like this one's here, it's muting. Yeah. Oh, now it's playing, and now this one's muting. So it's a whole crazy. vibe. There, there are a few players that do that really yeah. well, you know. And uh, it's a really cool effect, isn't it? Yeah. At the end of the day, like you it's know, just like a, it gives it so super, much yeah. Mo movement. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You can't do too much of it, yeah. but when you're in the right places, it can be quite creative. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah. All right, there you go. Cool. So there you go guys, thank you for watching another Pete and Vinny reaction video. As usual, if there's any other Brazilian guitarist you think Pete should react to, please let us know in the comments and we'll make sure that happens for you guys. And also let us know in the comments what you thought of this video. Did you like Fernando's playing and it's kind of perfect blend of all the rock techniques into one? thought that was pretty cool. And as usual, if you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more videos just like this one. So until next time, see ya! See ya.